Mostly cloudy skies tonight. Once the rain stops, 39 degrees for an overnight low. Tomorrow, we'll start the day off with some clouds and then mostly sunny in the afternoon with a high of 52. If you wake up in the overcast, it won't be around for long. Our high today, only 49, 57, our average high. We picked up three hundredths of an inch of precipitation in this very rainy October. We are above average for the year, and it is raining right now in Spokane and 46 degrees, also raining in 46 in Coeur d'Alene. Here's our Doppler radar showing the heavier rain right along the I-90 corridor from Cheney up through Spokane and into Coeur d'Alene. This is moving to the east and will be tapering off with dry conditions overnight. Well, we will be in a break between systems tomorrow. One exiting, a weak one approaching that's not going to give us too much trouble, and then another one on the way for a very wet Wednesday night and into Thursday. Here's a look at our jet stream forecast. We see that high pressure beginning to build in an approaching trough will not have much luck making its way in our direction through Wednesday. Here's Wednesday at 5 o'clock. However, this system moves in for wet weather starting overnight on Wednesday. Here's our forecast at our current time. Last of the showers move to the east. We're dry overnight with mostly cloudy skies. I'll stop it at 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. See a fair amount of clouds around the region. Kind of a bummer way to start the day, but then as we get into mid-morning, we clear out, see a little bit of sunshine, and then this next system comes in with the rain developing overnight and into a wet Thursday. Overnight lows tonight will be down in the 30s and 40s across the region. Our highs tomorrow in the 40s and 50s and even 60 tomorrow in Lewiston. Here's a look at your seven-day forecast. Dry tomorrow with some sunshine in the afternoon, very soggy Wednesday night. Right now it looks like that rain is going to start sometime around 2 a.m. and into Thursday day. Lingering showers on Friday. The change in the seven-day forecast is to remove the chance of rain in Spokane Saturday and Sunday. I still think we'll have some mountain showers with more rain possible Monday. Boy, a dry fall weekend with be just fantastic because we have had those those have been in short supply weren't you looking for some green here. bluff weather yes i would well, love a little perfect. green bluff weather yeah. on saturday and <laughs> sunday tomorrow i'm going to be on ice we are having a coats for kids donation night first one ever tomorrow at frontier ice arena in Coeur d'Alene. uh free skating if you bring me a coat Mm -hmm. Seahawks gloves, you can enter to win Seahawks tickets. Wow. I will be ice skating. I'm excited. Come <laughs> skate with me in Coeur d'Alene at Frontier Ice Arena to help support Coats for Kids. And you used to be quite the ice skater. Used to be. <laughs> that is not one of those sports you, that, you know, you can do your whole life. Yeah. It's, yeah. I, I mean, I can't, no. Right. So don't expect any tricks. She won't be on the skates. I on will be ice. on skates. Oh, I just will. won't be doing anything Ooh. too exciting okay. on Okay, we'll look forward to that.